Hey Parasites and welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog and I am out she outside where they're filming Venom 2 right now. Hey, what's up, Parasites? Welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog. And we actually got some news. I'm very excited. I'm glad I sat on it, too, because we got a look, a first look, I think, at Toxin. At least that's what some people are saying. And other people are saying it's Lasher because of the green, obviously. I saw someone being like, actually, the green symbiote is Lasher in the comics. I'm like, yeah, dude, you're <laughs> talking to the Venom channel. Like, yeah, I know Lasher's green, but I just didn't know to make him look more distinct in the movie if they were going to make Toxin green, and I saw other people reporting that it was Toxin and not last year. So, you know, I'll, I'll agree that it's up in the air. I, I'm pretty sure, though, that I heard it was Toxin. Uh, but again, I didn't hear that from, like, any reliable source or anything, and just people discussing it. So it's possible that it, this image here could be Toxin or last year. And if it's last year, that means maybe we'll see some other Life Foundation symbiotes in this film that we never really got or got hinted at in the first film. So that'll be interesting to see that if they, you know, we had speculation that maybe if they do the Life Foundation symbiotes, they'll do hybrid or something and have all of them combine. And that'll be the big threat that, you know, Eddie fights or something is, is some kind of symbiote that can bond with other symbiotes. And you saw that in the first movie where Riot tried to take the Venom symbiote from Eddie and just, you know, eat it or digest it. And then also Eddie taking Carnage symbiote and eating that in the second one. So this seems possible for, you know, symbiotes to ingest other ones. And, and you know, I don't know if that makes them more powerful or whatever. I'd love to see that come back in this film if Eddie and Venom are on the outs and it looks like they're going to fall. And then Eddie, you know, summons a version of Carnage, you know, hybrid where he's got like red spikes coming out of him and, you know, or extra heads and they're like Carnage heads, kind of like Venom the Madness. And he fights back. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see. I, there are a lot of, you know, crazy ideas out there, including my own. So I would love to see all this stuff. I'm, I'm all for the wacky when it comes to Venom and these movies deliver on that <laughs> pretty consistently. So uh, so for me, getting this news, I was like, okay, that's awesome. I'll make a video on it. But then I was like, I, I waited a little bit too long. I was working on other stuff. And I said, all right, well, now we got information that a new trailer is dropping. And I was like, all right, I'll just re-record -re the Toxin video then. And, uh, and we'll talk about this as well. So uh, And then also that there's more pickup shots. So, you know, Tom Hardy is in Vegas right now doing more pickups for the movie. Just little things that they just wanted to add to the final edit and stuff. So these aren't reshoots. I see people once again calling these reshoots. These aren't scenes that were already filmed and being refilmed. As far as I know, they're literally new scenes. So that that's, constitutes them as pickup shots, which happens in most films. And not all of them. I know James Gunn, I think, has famously come out and said that he really has a vision of what he wants to do. And he tries to get everything in one go and kind of avoids reshoots and pickups and stuff like that. Um, because sometimes it is. It's hard to get some of the actors back, you know, and put them in makeup again. And it's a lot of work sometimes. So I can understand why he tries to do it that way. And I think all filmmakers do, but it's always in the budget to do some pickups or reshoots if you need them, typically. Um, so this is nothing out of the normal. I'm glad they're doing a couple pickups if they feel like this stuff will make the movie better or help flesh out something that maybe in the edit they were like, oh, you know what? Something like this could make this make more sense or whatever. And sometimes that happens. You know, they say you make a movie three times, once in pre-production, once when you're filming it, and then once in the editing room. And sometimes you're in the editing room and go, all right, we got something here, but this would help improve that. And if we can't do it in ADR, maybe we can just film this quick scene real quick. And that's what it seems like they're doing in Vegas. So I'm glad I sat on the Toxin slash Lasher image because now we got the pickup information. And then once again, we got the trailer information, which is dropping on Thursday. So definitely on Thursday after Purple gets out of work, I will film a reaction video to that trailer and I'll post it before midnight on Thursday so that it gets out there, you know, as quickly as possible. So you know, I'm glad we're on this train where we're just a couple weeks from the movie. I'm hoping at the end of this trailer, they'll say tickets are available to start purchasing because around that time, we'll be about five, six weeks away from the film coming out. And I'm getting more and more excited. You know, I can't wait to see this film with you guys and to kind of bring home and close out this whole trilogy that we've been following ever since the first film for the past six years, six and a half years. And it's been amazing. And I really am grateful for all of you for still watching the channel and uh, and getting hyped up for venom hopefully you are if you if you're not or if you are whatever it is let me know down below what do you think of this toxin slash lasher who do you think it is do you think it's lasher do you think it's toxin i'd love to hear those comments and then we can keep discussing that down below the pickup shots what are you hoping some of those will be um, i'm thinking it's just to touch up a couple story beats for the vegas stuff but you know that's just my speculation 
And then also, what are you, you know, excited for the trailer? What do you want to see in the trailer? And are you entering the art contest? Uh, I have been working very hard on uh, coming up with a concept, and I think I finally landed on one. And it is one that is going to be a little different as far as like something you don't normally see on a movie poster. It feels more like an album cover in a way. But I know Tom's a fan of like Czarface and you know other rappers and musicians, so I'm hoping that this draws their eye as, as something that stands out as a movie poster and maybe brings a different vibe to it. Um, but it also, I think, hopefully sums up what I feel the movie is about, which, uh, you know, from the first trailer. So we'll see with the second trailer if that influences me to change anything. But I'm pretty much, you know, ha I think I have my idea in mind and I'm going to focus on it. So let me know if you're entering the contest, you know, what kind of stuff are you doing? Are you sharing your concept art? I am on my Instagram. So if you want to follow me, link is down below and I'd love to hear your thoughts. So thank you guys so much for watching the channel as always. And we will have more Venom vlog stuff coming soon. Hopefully those shorts for the Venom War are uploading. Um, you know, I'll get those up immediately if they're not already up. And, uh, and those will go up on the shorts. Uh, so there'll be one minute reviews of each issue of Venom War, which I am not really enjoying that book at all. I love Ibon's artwork, but you know, you'll see my thoughts on those videos. But I don't know if I'll be able to read every issue now because I feel like I'm, I'm not getting my money's worth. So we'll talk about that in the shorts. But for here, I just want to let you know more Venom content is coming and this movie's coming out soon. So, you know, obviously good times ahead for all of us Venom fans. Thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And we'll see you in the future. Peace.